Ranch Realtors, we believe football is family, and every family deserves a good home. Gunder Reese, defensive tackle. I sack the quarterback in my house. Heath Fleming, linebacker. I stuff the run in my house. Braden Johnson, cornerback. I snag interceptions in my house. Jack Curtin, cornerback. I'm a ball hawk in my house. Kyler Kersey, right tackle. And I make pancakes in my house. Carter Rogers, center, and I paved the way in my house. Tristan Letcher, defensive end. I battle in the trenches in my house. Michael Nelson, nose guard. I eat running backs for breakfast in my house. Parker Stokes, outside linebacker. I put in work in my house. Big Tapska, running back. I score touchdowns in my house. This is Montoya, nose guard, and I cause destruction in my house. As Taylorville's leader in home internet marketing, we utilize state-of-the-art equipment to create stunning photos that showcase your home's unique charm. We understand the digital first generation. Whether you're a seller or a buyer, we keep you connected. And we put your home in front of thousands of prospective buyers using popular social media channels and over 80 different internet sites. We have access to over 1,500 agents through the multiple listing service, ensuring that you never miss that perfect home. The Taylorville Tornadoes may already be in their house, but for everyone else, there's Craig's Realtors in Taylorville. This is our house! Brandon and I, you know, showed off the arm a little bit, had 400 yard passing. Yeah, I mean, we, we've got some weapons, and, you know, he's a weapon, we've got Parker's a weapon now out of the backfield, and we've got some guys that can catch the ball and can run with the ball and things like that, and we had some good things go our way. Uh, I mean, he's earned the right to, to play well, and, and he's kind of fought through injury and kind of fought through, uh, you know, coach, head coach getting on him all the time. Uh, but uh, it's good for him, it's good for our program. It's, it's, it's a great night for our program. 41-0 on senior night. To get the taste out of our mouth from last week is, is really good. It really feels good. It's really big and the defensive staff did a great job of trying to come together with a plan to kind of counter some of their size. And you saw them, they were almost 300 pounds up front uh, across the board. Uh, offensively, the you know, game plan we had was to execute and, and to attack the perimeter, which we did very well tonight. Uh, so just a great job all around, and I could be proud of the kids and the coaches. So they're a good football team with some size that we had to have an answer for, and answer tonight was, you know, putting the ball in the air a little bit, uh, using some of our quickness versus some of their size. I'm really proud of the response. I mean, that's, quite frankly, that was, <laughs> that was that. If you had to ask me, you know, if I thought, you know, tonight's game was gonna go like that, I. I didn't think so. When we watched them on film, you know, we watched Civic on film, we thought, holy cow, it was physical. And that's a really physical, big football team. And I was really proud of our guys. They came out and they dominated from the get-go. And yeah, I mean, it's that's what you want to see right now going into next week. So, I mean, very impressed, happy, um, got to get better at some things. But yeah, pretty happy with that. That, that was pretty, that's pretty good performance right there. Jordy was, he was all over the place back there, it seemed like, you know, and it, that's, that's, he, he played lights out. That's the best game I've seen him play, and that's credit to him. Coach Wolf and Coach Simple Camp for, you know, making him as good as he is. And, uh, yeah, I mean, that's one of the things we've had a hard time, seems like, this year. You know, we've been, you know, hard at getting, the, you know, it's been hard getting the takeaways, you know, and that's, um, you know, they come and go, and, you know, tonight when you get them like that, you can really put a lot of pressure on a team, and, you know, that was an example of that. We could, you know, when you, Create some takeaways, you know, yards don't beat you, points do, and you just kind of, you know, if you get the ball and get some extra positions for your offense, the way they were clicking tonight, you know, good things are going to happen. You can get a lot of momentum your way pretty fast. I think that's to me, was the biggest thing. It's just like these guys, you know, they don't lose here. That's one of the things. And that's like last week was really hard because I don't know, you know, we were you know, talking to them. It's like, you know, other than last week, we hadn't lost on this, you know, that group has not lost on this football field a lot at all. And like they had like a, I think a, you know, other than last week, the last time they lost was two years ago in the 5A playoffs here. You know, and that's, that's so that when they play here, they usually play lights out. Last week, they didn't play really great. 
and we got into them pretty good on you know Monday of the film it's like hey this is not who we are and tonight for them to come out and respond to me I was so proud of them because those guys are it's it's they're so much fun to be around and I you know from a coaching staff we're, we don't we're not wishing this time away at all and because we love being around these guys so much they're just they're an awesome they're just awesome to come to work Well, we just knew that us seniors, this could be our last time playing on this home field, so we had to take advantage of it and show them that we weren't to be walked over and uh, our defense performed, put up a zero, and our offense running clocked them. So there's no, I could not have asked for a better senior night with some better teammates. You know, you know, I don't know if we're going to be home or away. We're a seven to two team, which pretty much, you know, a lot of times means we're going to be a away team. Uh, we need the community to come out and support these kids. Uh, you know, as we may hopefully make a little bit of a run in the playoffs. That's the thing. Is like when you, we, like I said, we watched them on film. We're like, holy cow, this is going to be a physical thing. And, you know, we really played well. And you know, credit to our kids and our, you know, our assistant coaches on defense, Coach Allwork, Coach Hannigan, Coach Warsham, Coach Simple Camp, Coach Wolf. You know, they just flat out got them ready to play this week. And um, but yeah, the momentum huge because they I mean when we play good we're good I mean we're really good and I told them that last night you when know, we walked off you know got done with walkthroughs it's like you got to believe we're a good football team because you are yeah, you, you know you, their confidence was a little rattled but um, when they play like they play tonight they're gonna be a really tough out for somebody and it doesn't matter who play it right now.